Okay, so welcome to the uh, welcome to the auction for this beautiful belt drive Garrard GT20. Um, the way I introduced that, then I might have sounded like I know a little bit a bit about turntables, but I don't really. Uh, I know it's a Garrard, um, and they're a respected manufacturer making the higher end stuff. Um, just give you a little look here. A uh, little bit of a little bit of dirt and grime, but nothing that won't wipe off. In fact, I might wipe it off during this video. So it's the Garrard GT20, 4533. It's got anti-skate, and yeah, you them a flips at the end here, which are all very nice and sort of twiddle to adjust the weight. I haven't set up the tone arm. Um, the cartridge appears to me, to the untrained eye, to be perfectly good. Anyway, it's. Uh, I guess the best thing for me to do is just show you that it's working. So I'm making this video of the thing as is, as it's going to be packaged. So no dodgy people like the last one who bought something off me saying that there was no flipping cartridge on it, just so that he could nick it for himself. Uh, here we go. See, there's not a lot of crackle on there. Renee and George and I'm sure the mobile phone video will not give you an impression of sound quality, <laughs> but just to make the point that it is working. Whether you'd want to buy a new needle or give it a service or anything, I don't know, but clearly, clearly we have a lovely working turntable and it's simplest form. So that's, I mean, that sounds to me, and I, I, I'm not a great connoisseur but I like my Paul Simon and that sounds to me like a decent um, let me just that sounds to me like a decent she says it's a Shaw ED12 on there I think that says a Shaw ED12 needle lovely so if anybody wants to get back into their vinyl nice and cheap that looks like a great way of doing it to me you're going to get some lovely sound out of that. That sounds beautiful. Um, I've, got some, I've got some nice connectors here. I'll include these for you if you want. I'll include those. It hasn't got a lid with it, but it looks far more attractive without the lid anyway. Just give it a dust once in a while. So there you go. Working as you can see, and I'm about to list this on the auction right now. So uh, what you see is what you get. Okay, best of luck.